What's up, y'all? It is your girl, Angel, and welcome back to Angel's Life. All right, y'all. So listen, I'm a little bit late. You hear me? I'm not always done with your call, but I'm always on down. All right. I am going to be showing y'all my outfit of the days. I say that in air quotations because I didn't go out every day. So a few of them are mock. But I'm going to be showing y'all my outfit of the days from last week. Y'all know April is supposed to be my no buy month. And we are supposed to be shopping our closet for looks. Now. Okay. We're going to get into some details a little bit later. But four of the outfits I actually wore. We're going from the first to the sixth. Four of the outfits that I actually wore. Two of them. I want to say I did not. Uh, one, two, three. Five. So I have five looks. So, yeah, four of them I wore, one of them I did not. And I guess I'm missing a day. So you're only getting five looks. It is what it is. <laughs> but before we get into the video, I do want to say welcome to all my new subscribers. Welcome back to all my day ones and stuff, y'all. How y'all doing? My name is Angel. I run a style, travel, and lifestyle channel. So if any of that sounds interesting to you, please go ahead and click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell to be notified when I upload new videos. Now, Let's jump into the video. So the reason that I am doing the what I wore in a week is because in my last video, I stated that in April I would be doing a no buy month. I asked if y'all wanted me to show y'all what I would wear in a week shopping that closet because we had been purchasing things from January to March. That's three months, 90 days worth of shopping you know, so to speak. Obviously, we're not shopping every day, but y'all get the gist. That's three months, 90 days worth of shopping. We should be able to manage for 30 days. If we have been shopping with intention and do shopping smart and doing the right things, we should be able to garner a wardrobe for 30 days. Can I get an amen? Okay. Now that April is here and our first week has passed, I am elated to say all right <laughs> bitch we did a horrible job you understand me <laughs> we didn't stop the thing okay because we ain't doing good at all baby let me tell you one thing for certain two things for sure <laughs> I ain't been doing it right. I ain't been doing it right. Y'all listen to the wrong person because when I had to go in that closet and create practical outfits for my life <laughs> I was struggling <laughs> I was struggling. I was shocked. <laughs> I was shocked. And <laughs> listen, unless I'm wearing my resort wear on the streets, baby, the closet is full with that. I don't know what did happen. I don't know what's going on. Practical wear. I must have just realized this in March because I know I talked a lot about practicality in March, right? I must have missed that in January and February. <laughs> And y'all didn't tell me. Y'all didn't tell me. So it's really y'all fault. Why didn't y'all tell me? Um. I created my no buy in my April no buy accountability chat. And there was a few things that have prevented me from continuing on in the, um, uh, the accountability group chat on Instagram, even though the girls are still going strong. Shout out to all y'all beautiful queens. And thank y'all for understanding why I had to step back. Um, I did actually buy a few things and then return them as what I bought them for the deal that I was uh, doing. It's it's not it's kind of on a bag burner. It's whatever the case is. That's neither here nor there. But uh, y'all. We're going to have to rework this, okay? Because when I tell y'all there is little to no practicality in my wardrobe, it's insane. Like, I do I have practical pieces? Yes. Do I have enough practical pieces? Absolutely not, especially not for the spring. Now, I'm low-key ready for the summer, not the spring. And that is because, y'all, I don't have any layering pieces, no layering pieces, no sweaters. All I have is denim jackets. Literally, all I have is denim jackets. Yeah, I mean, I know I love denim, but Jesus Christ, girl, what are you doing? Yeah. 
it was a fail flop flute. Fail flop flute. And we're gonna, we're gonna work on it. We're gonna work on it. We need a lot of work and we're gonna work on it. You understand? But let's, let's, now that I, I babbled on enough and I've told y'all how much of a flip flop flute it was, let me actually show y'all what I did come up with for April 1st through the 6th. Now, mind you, I did it on like a five, actually, first to the six. Yeah, it was first to six. We're gonna, I'm gonna show y'all the five looks, okay? One look, you know, stay your ass at home. Wear loungewear. I insert a picture of some loungewear that you could wear for that day. Stay your ass at home. You ain't got nowhere to go. All right, y'all. So, day one. This is in no particular order. And I do want to say this. The weather in San Antonio is up and down. Up and down. One day it's 87 degrees outside and the next is 70. So some, and, and a little windy. So sometimes you might need a jacket and then sometimes you don't. Like sometimes you need to be out there in your coochie cutters, girl. Why are you not in your coochie cutters? Come on. Okay, so first look is this tracksuit. Now y'all have seen this jacket. Y'all had not seen the bottoms. I ordered the bottoms the day after I ordered the jacket. And y'all know the jacket came in the day that I recorded that uh, video. So y'all hadn't seen the pants. But this tracksuit, clutch, 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 clutch. It's practical as hell, it's affordable as hell, and it's cute as hell. Because y'all, I wore this to um, an orientation for Angel's new school. Compliments galore from the moment that I stepped in the door to everywhere else that I went that day. Compliments on compliments on compliments. The girls are like, girl, you look, somebody literally said you look like an influencer. Girl, that's what she said, girl. You know me. I was like, oh, thank you. I am. I am. <laughs> she, she was like, I see it. She was like, I can tell. So cute. And then, of course, I told her, I got it from Target. I should have gave that bitch my link. I should have been like, girl, here you <laughs> But I just, told her, I, I just told her that I got it from Target. Um, Eats down. <laughs> Super comfortable, super cute. I have it paired with my Air Max um, Vapor Plus. Nike, come up with a better name. Hated it, okay? And then when I went out that day, I also had it paired with my uh, my Alma BB. But I will say a backpack would have been perfect. It would have just really added to like the casual leisureness of the look. But your girl ain't had no goddamn backpack. But I got my Alma BB. It was the closest in color, so that's what we wore. It was a eat, a eat, a eat. And I loved every piece of it. And I wore that on... So this is not going to be any particular order. This is just what I wore the days, okay? So that's the first look. Let's move on to look number two. All right, y'all. So look number two. I have my blue Aritzia top, my um, seven for all mankind, like really wide lit jeans. And then I have my American Eagle denim trench coat over it. So originally I did not have the trench coat over it. I just had the Aritzia top and the jeans, but it rained that day. So I ended up, but I, I ended up grabbing the trench coat some like in the middle of the day. Um, y'all, it's an eat. I have it paired with the shoots uh, or shoots denim uh, sandals, coach denim tabby. So easy. Gucci sunglasses because it was sunny that day until it started raining and got a little cool. So cute. So cute. Again, so many compliments. People were like, oh my God, I love your outfit. I love your outfit. I love your outfit. Girl, me too. This is a really cute look. This is so cute, so simple, very practical. I, I love this one. She cannot lie. She loved this one, y'all. She really, she really loved this one. So easy. So easy and so, like, these first two looks are really, really practical, right? And I have a couple 
really practical looks in there just not enough not enough of this not enough of the throw it on and out the door we go so we really have to hone in on that moving forward you know but again this is a marathon not a sprint so we are going to take our time but we need to really think about what's missing y'all know i said i have the layering pieces that i have are all denim so we need a knit sweater that's a neutral color that'll go with a lot you know like we going to get there. We going to get there. We fall down, but we get up. Yeah. Next. Next look. All right, y'all. So look number three. Denim frame dress. So I'm going to be honest with y'all. She's a go-to. Y'all know I got her back in February, and as soon as I was able to wear her, she has been a go-to. I was a little concerned with how short, because I did get her hemmed. I was a little concerned with how short I got her hemmed, but I did get these, like, biker shorts to wear underneath it. And, girl, with the biker shorts, we are good to go. <laughs> we are good to go. I have I had them styled with my, um, just a pair of black socks. These, like, off white and yellow Sam Edelman sneakers, blue head wrap, yellow sunglasses. And I have worn this look twice this way with two different bags. I've worn it with my coach Tabby and I've worn it with my Alma BB because I think the look works with both. So it's kind of an either or. It's kind of a, you know, pick your day of the week. Do you have a lot of shit to carry or a little? Because if you got a lot of shit to carry, baby, don't take that coach Tabby. Okay, you can't fit nothing in there. But I love this one. Again, these three looks are giving really practical. Really practical, really cute, really... Really eating. <laughs> eating it up. Loved it. A lot of compliments again. Just, and it's so simple. Like, that's what I loved about it. Like, effortlessly chic. These three looks are effortlessly chic and I can we add a, a a slash or or dash casual like they're effortlessly chic and casual casual that's what we're missing right let me rephrase what I said in the beginning I have a lot of effortlessly chic looks in the closet what I lack is the casual part and casual and practical in my opinion go hand in hand I don't know what that I don't know what that is but that's they go like that they go together and I have the effortlessly chic looks I do not have enough of the casual the practical and casual so I really have to dig into that bag because she's 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 running low she almost on e but we're gonna get there again marathon not a sprint so moving on to the next look look number four i actually do have six looks so i was right um two filling looks so look number four this is actually another look that i wore y'all have not seen these pants yet but i have these banana republic wide leg linen pants Mm, y'all weren't ready y'all weren't ready for me to go <laughs> y'all i love the pants i love these goddamn pants i did get them tailored so that they look nice with a flip-flop i have it with my black pumi tank top um black head wrap marnie bag i'm ready for the beach and errands all at the same time i could literally go to the grocery store hop on a flight be on the beach the same day frolicking in the sand frolicking in the sand y'all love this look it was one of those days where it was 87 degrees i threw this on everybody kept asking me where i got my pants from everybody girl where'd you get your pants where'd you get your pants i love those where'd you get your pants banana republic <laughs> i really Y'all absolutely love these linen pants so much. I love, so I don't know what hit, what it has become. I feel like I've always loved them, but maybe they just weren't in style. So I wasn't seeing them like that because I've always loved the wide leg pant. But when I tell you I'm in my wide leg bag, 
I mean, like, why lick bag? Y'all better act like y'all know. Y'all better act like y'all know, okay? And then when I be walking, and then my headphones, I had a cowboy Carter on. Easy. <laughs> Easy. Y'all, love this look down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Sam Edelman sandals. I said that bag. Okay, moving on. Okay, y'all. So the fifth look is actually an evening look. Went on a date last week. White Aritzia top. Y'all, these knit tops, we love them. Okay, just wanted to throw that out there. But white Aritzia top, black, seven for mankind jeans. Y'all hadn't seen these yet either. These are also going to be in the next new end video, but seven for mankind jeans, Michael Kors metallic, um, metallic platform heels, denim urban revival jacket, PG bag, very nice spring date night vibe. Okay. Cause we're giving, we're giving a little skin and a little sexy with the crop top. Okay. But then we're giving the jacket like just in case it's cold in the restaurant or in the theater or in the comedy club, wherever we're going, we're covered. We have the heel, but we're still casual with the jeans. Love it. I love the look. Love the look. Very easy. Very easy. Very easy. Love that. But I will say this can absolutely be worn in the day. But I do feel like it leans towards more evening vibes. But yeah. Last look. So, the last look, aloe jumpsuit. You can't go wrong with her, girl. Aloe jumpsuit, aloe jacket, on, um, on cloud sneakers. I had the YSL um, college bag to go with it. College, college. I actually pull out that jumpsuit at least once a week. I don't feel like getting dressed. I when I really don't feel like getting dressed, excuse me, y'all, are putting forth any real effort into my look. I'm always going to my workout gear. So each week, y'all are probably going to see one of my aloe workout gears in at least one day because there are some days that I'm just like girl be gone I don't want to do it so yes and I actually wore that so you know I'm gonna be honest with y'all I wore all of that last week I, the, but one of the days includes um the last day of March the very last day of March I wore one of those but I actually wore all of these last week so six looks there's seven days in a week for the seven day loungewear insert picture leave the link for it it skims stay your ass at home save your money i don't know what else to tell you but y'all those are the seven looks six looks seven looks because we got the loungewear those are the seven looks that is what i wore in a week i'm hoping next week will be easier i'm hoping next week which is this week will be easier i will say so far i haven't uh gone out much this week because again i have been under the weather y'all y'all see me Y'all see y'all y'all see me pat my nose like go get like I'm on a book of sugar. Y'all see me pat my uh hand. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm gonna have to cut that out. Um, but y'all see me constantly pat my nose, and that is genuinely because it's running and because I have been up under the weather I have not been out much this past week but I'm still gonna give y'all seven days worth of looks video should be out on Sunday but I love y'all so much comment down below let me know what was your favorite look 
make sure y'all follow me on Instagram at Angel's Life and on TikTok at One Angel's Life. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell. I love y'all so much. Thank you for watching. And I will see y'all in the next video. Peace.